Good day, welcome to Unity with Heaven. My name is Joseph, and today I'm here with Kim Lee, and we are going to minister to 10 people. Uh, so, if you would also like to receive ministry in this format, please write your name in the comments, and I will put you on my schedule and I'll minister uh, to you. So, right now, I'm about five days ahead with my list of names. Uh, then uh, I'll uh, how far we are with ministering and so as people put their names in the comments i just add them so if you add your name now you probably need to wait about five days and then you'll see sure. the video will come out <laughs> when we minister to you but you can just check it out every day see if your name is there also remember when you listen to a prophetic word all the prophetic words that we give to all those people you can receive all of it just like you read the scriptures that were written thousands of years before to other people you can read it and say lord i received that scripture in the same way you can also take a prophetic word and if the holy spirit says but that's for you you can receive that you we receive from the lord by faith all right so i want to start to minister the first person i want to minister to is militia okay so militia what the lord was showing to me is how he gives you a mentor that trains you and how a mantle of God, the anointing of God come upon your life. How the Lord uses you in ministry and he uses you also just in life as a person that's anointed by the Lord, a light that shines brightly and I see how you go up levels in your growth of God and also in your maturity as a minister in the kingdom of God. Uh, Melissa the Lord shows me how he is replacing the wheels on the car and I felt the car was your life, it was your finances, is uh, what was happening in your life and I just see how the Lord puts new wheels on uh, and he just uh, gives you a new strategy, a new ability to move forward. All right, God bless you. Amen. Thanks for this for Joe. Joe, the Lord shows me how this complete turnaround, this complete shift. The, the Lord shows me how you are looking at this mirror and how you don't see your reflection anymore, but you only see the Lord. Uh, you only see Jesus in, in your acts and in your fruit. The Lord is showing, showing me because that is happening because you are taking such good care of your roots taking care of knowing that that you are planted in the Lord and it's everything first comes from the roots and then it will appear on the trees so I hear the Lord saying continue and he is so so proud of you and in any times that you feel like you are not getting enough water the Lord is saying he is always flowing and he's asking you to come and drink be blessed hey Joe I really feel that the Lord is saying to you that every single person in your family will be healed by the Lord and that the Lord is going to bring complete restoration to you because you were the one that says, Lord, let's open up a door for you, move in our lives. And I just see how the Lord comes and he moves in your lives. And just like the Egyptians, they had the blood on the doorposts and that kept the spirit of death away from entering into the house of the Israelites, I felt because you said, Lord, I'm going to be a gatekeeper. I'm standing in a way. I see how uh, the Lord is raising you up as a covering and as a protection for your family and how the Lord then comes in and bring healing and peace into your family. God bless you, Joe. Uh, so the next person I want to minister is uh, Ariel. All right. uh, so Ariel, uh, I was praying for you and the Lord showed me that he has called you as a leader. And so the Lord is strengthening you today as a leader. And then the Lord said to me, a clear financial plan. And I felt as you pray, the Lord is going to give you a clear financial plan and a strategy for 2025. And I felt 2025 is not going to be the same as 2024. Uh, and you're going to have clarity of vision and you're going to apply wisdom in your life. God bless you. Uh, Amen, Ariel, please leave us a comment saying to this for juggling. This, the, the Lord shows me how he's holding, his, he's holding your hands up and he is helping you to, to hold on. The Lord says, do not let go of the rope. Do not let go of, 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 his, of his robe. And I hear the Lord saying that, there, that a miracle is coming. And, and don't, don't lose faith. Don't lose prayer. Don't let the enemy make you think that, um, oh, th this is not working. This is not getting anywhere. I hear the Lord saying that he's going to, he's, he's wanting to teach you, um, um, persistence and not to give up. Um, and the, i um, the Lord has promised you things and he will keep his promises. Be blessed. Okay. So Jacqueline, uh, the Lord is just giving me a unity in a family. And so the Bible says when, uh, two, uh, walk together, then they can, 
overcome 10,000 where the one can only overcome 1,000 with God. And so I felt that the Lord says unity because the Lord commands his blessing where people walk in unity. Uh, God bless you Jacqueline. So next word is for Ifeshuku. Uh, Ifeshuku, the Lord says to me vision and purpose. Uh, that was the first one and the second one the Lord said to me that you are going to receive your income from a different income stream in 2025 and 2024 and so I felt changes is coming and transition is coming and so the Lord is even giving you new vision it's giving you clear clarity of pur purpose and you're going to make some decisions and you're going to weed out things that's holding you back and you're going to hook yourself onto things that's going to pull you into the destiny and the future that God has for you. And I just felt that the Lord says the enemy wants to steal the hope and say it's all over. But God is saying, no, I have a plan for you. Just trust me and walk with me. I'm going to provide for you. God bless you, Ifeshuku. Amen, Ifeshuku. Please leave us comments. Next word is for Ingrid. Ingrid, the Lord shows shows me um are you writing and you being very very creative in many things and i hear the lord saying that everything that you do let it be worship unto me let it glorify my name and i and the lord shows me how how don't let anybody he wants you to show your faith to others show them um speak about the lord and more often it, it's not like in a, in a sense that somebody's like saying, oh, I had no idea you were Christian. I hear the Lord saying that you have a good heart, that you have good fruit, but he wants you to, to, to testify and speak more because you have a, a lot of wisdom and, and so much to share. Be blessed. Oh, hey, awesome. Uh, uh, Ingrid, God bless you. He loves you very, very much. Uh, and uh, where you were frail, I just see how the Lord makes you like a lion. He makes you very, very strong. Uh, and full of that um, uh, joy and that peace and the righteousness of God as the layers of protection over your life. God bless you, uh, Ingrid. Okay, so uh, Cherise, um, the Lord showed me a tree uh, that was dry and how the Lord puts life into the tree. And suddenly it made new leaves, it made new fruit, and I felt that the Lord says, I'm putting life in you. Uh, and then the Lord gave me... Um, out of you because of that fruit there's going to be many ministry opportunities that's going to be in your life you're going to you're going to um, connect with with people in the church you're going to get lots of opportunities to pray for people encourage to them even prophesy the word of god and i saw fruit in every area of your life because of the life of god in you god bless you Amen, Cherise. Uh, this next word is for uh, Renee. Renee, the Lord shows me how you have, how you are just so, so lovely and so precious to the Lord. The Lord shows me how, how He is coming, and and I see how He wraps these these bandages around you and around your home, and He just comes and 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 He just covers you again. I feel the Lord saying that He is coming with a fresh covering, that you will, that you will feel His presence, that that you have made a way, that you have made a space for the Lord. He say, Lord, come in here, come into my home, come into my my heart again, and 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 just come and embrace me with my with your presence i hear uh the lord saying that he is coming as as a father just to just to embrace you and he wants you to know that he loves you so so much and you are so precious to him be blessed hey awesome uh renee um i saw that you put your names of your two children and your husband also so they are on the list they're not on this video but uh on the next video that we're gonna make i see their names is on there so just check you'll see uh, we'll minister to them all right, so the next person I want to minister to uh, is Stella. Okay, so Stella, the Lord gave to me uh, that the drought is broken. And I saw these clouds that came always into your life. Uh, they, they had a black color, but they just never produced rain. So it's like opportunities. You think they're going to go through, uh, come through, but then they kind of just blow away. But I see this time the clouds come in. They are black, full of rain, and then they rain. And the Lord says, I'm breaking financial and are breaking spiritual drought in your life and so even in this season coming you're gonna have a revival on the inside of you as the lord fills you afresh with his holy spirit and just revive your first love for jesus and then in the same way i see how the lord gives you wisdom to connect with doors of opportunity that the lord is giving to you to 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 bless you with finances god bless you uh, Amen. Stella, please leave us comment. Thanks for this for James. James, the Lord shows me how you are building something, and I hear the Lord saying, "Have patience and and take your time and do it properly." The Lord shows me how He is giving you even even more ideas that He is 
that you have opened your mind to to receive um, and you've opened your, your spirit to receive more from the Lord, more, more wisdom that he is giving to you. And the Lord shows me how, how when, you, when you make something, you want to, um, to do it properly. And, and the Lord says that that's good. That's what he wants you to do. The Lord shows me how you are carrying around a, a briefcase. Um, but this is, uh, this is just what I see. How you are carrying around this briefcase. And to know that most people, everything that they need like for work is in, in a briefca briefcase briefcase and I hear the Lord saying that, that everything that you need for this job for this business that you want to make or this or this job opportunity that you have or the work that you have currently everything that you need is found in the Lord do not fear be blessed yeah James the the Lord has really made a provision for everything in your life the enemy wants to sow fear but you can trust him he is going to provide for you Hey family, uh, it was a pleasure for me and Kimli to minister uh, to all of you. Uh, we are going to be back again uh, on Friday where we're going to minister. So you can come Friday night, half past seven, South African time. And then of course, Mondays at six o'clock, that's when we go live and you can come receive ministry. And also, if you would like to receive ministry in this format, just write your names in the comments and we'd love to minister to you. We love and appreciate each one of you. God bless you. Thank you for joining Unity with Heaven. Remember to subscribe, like, comment and join our newsletter. If you want to support us, please click on the PayPal link. May God bless you abundantly. Remember, you are valuable and we love and appreciate each one of you. If you enjoyed this content and you want to see more, please click here.